I know a lot of people are like, how can you stream like this? That doesn't make any sense. I, I've had people like question like the validity of, of my illness and stuff. But it's just like when you're sick all the time, that's what and that's what normies don't understand. When you're sick all the time, and you have a chronic illness, you learn how to function at like the worst conditions of your life. And feeling like shit just becomes normal for you. So I feel like shit every day. And it takes a lot to like knock me down to the point where it's like, oh shit. Oh, IBS is ta My heart goes out to you if you have IBS. I, I don't know how you deal with that. I, let me tell you something. I don't have IBS, but when my gallbladder died and I had to get it surgically removed and I was learning how to live without a gallbladder, that was like the worst. I was in recovery for like over a year for my gallbladder and that was just like the worst, the worst experience ever. Oh my god. It was like, it was so bad. Once it's out, not for me. Unfortunately, I'm a little different because of my condition. Like, I get uh, infections when I get surgeries and stuff. So, I ended up getting an uh, infection and I had to be in the hospital for quite a bit after the surgery. It took me some time to get back home. And then I had, to, I was, I was basically like in bed for a long time. It was, it was pretty bad. Like, if you think of like when people have surgery, they have to recover. But for me, recovery for a surgery is like twice as long because I always get infections after and I heal very, very slowly. So like I've had like sinus surgeries and stuff. And it's like for, for a sinus surgery, usually like after like a week, you're fine. For me, it took me like four months to recover from a, from a fucking sinus surgery. It was terrible. Oh God, my appendix, it took me... It took me like six six months to recover from my appendix, from my appendectomy. That was pretty bad. I remember I spent like the whole time playing video games like in bed and stuff.